Hello. It's Jack. You know, something uh, happened. I, I don't know to whom, and I'm not sure quite why it was so uh, so exotic and exciting. Um, it's not really exactly trolling, but a lot of the times I, I wonder what people are actually making of some of the things I say, considering a lot of them aren't necessarily, strictly speaking, true, and I rarely say the most important ones. And then the most important thing is um, no, nobody's actually doing what they're supposed to be doing. Uh, for example, the, the water went out. And then I sent emails and stuff. No, nobody responded to the emails. Nobody, nobody got back anytime soon. Uh, it's almost as though there's some sort of time dilation effect or something. I don't know, whatever it is, but whatever it is, it um, had some other effects. And then I, I guess nobody's actually interested in what's actually going on. Well, I mean, you, you probably know everything. Why would you need to hear from me, honestly? And then uh, you called and I hung up on you. I'm sorry about that. There's something about the person that you're not sometimes uh, that's an issue. Bye. I'm tired of this bandwidth being hoovered up by these ruffians who live next door. I'm tired of not having water. I'm tired of treating. <clears throat> I'm tired of putting up with this bullshit. All right. <clears throat> and then you called twice, so I called you back. That's the only issue. And you're not blocked. So if you'd kindly stop crying about it, that'd be great. Maybe somebody is blocked to you, and then I don't know anything about it because they're bouncing off me to get to you, and then you try to go through that bridge, and you don't know that you're going through a bridge because, you know, frankly, I don't know what kind of technological sophistication you have, but I think it starts and stops with your goddamn fingernails <clears throat> and your shoes and your hair. And, um, <clears throat> well, maybe that's not damned by God, but nevertheless, uh, you know, I'm not the one causing the problems with the connectivity around here. All right? So maybe you can tell that to your pancake buddies. Bye. Hello, Dana. You know, I, I wonder I wonder what I wonder what you think is going on, honestly. I'm not I'm not entirely sure you're up to speed. Uh, <clears throat> you can call me back if you like. I don't know if it'll work. Sorry about that. Bye. Uh, by the way, I'm not, I'm not mad about anything, although you might you might imagine that I am, depending on uh, which of you answers the phone. Hey, you're not my agent, but it, look, can you call the mouse woman and find out what she knows about the luggage that goes to Enumclaw? Because I don't want to drive out there for nothing, and I don't want to keep carrying it around, and I, I have no reason to go out there unless it's uh, worth my time. And it's obviously not a the dude left it there as a, as a trap. And then I, the only the best place I know where to where to take it is the Enum Claw Police Department. But I don't feel like going to fucking Enum Claw unless uh, uh, unless unless well find out if this woman's actually working a working a gig because God, is so fucking arrogant these days. You know, women's lib has ruined this country. Anyway, that's that's all that's all I need. Um, <clears throat> Uh, from you. Bye. <clears throat> um, I found out the mouse woman is police, and uh, the SCD panel came back negative. I, I don't have any HIV. I don't have any, any diseases. And, um, do you all know how jurisdiction works? None, none of you have jurisdiction over me. So it doesn't matter if you're cops or if you want to take my stuff, you don't get to. The badge doesn't work, and I'm protected. And, I mean, you're only friends with people who are cops or people that you want to steal from. Um, well, I, I, I did think you were a little socially awkward, but I didn't realize that it was uh, that bad. I mean, um, I don't, I don't need police. If I did, I'd, I'd call dispatch. So. And then not pay attention to the fact that you're not the boss of me. Uh, you're not very smart police. Good luck. Why do you think I was so insistent on publicly saying that I had HIV? That seems like a really hateful thing to say, especially since I, I don't. Um, do, do you happen to know why? 
because I, I got some theories. And then um, I'm not entirely certain that it's trustworthy, but uh, I did get a standard STD panel done, and they said I was negative for seven or eight diseases, including HIV. Um, I don't think it necessarily works that way, but uh, the most important thing is, is that I, I didn't cheat on anybody. I had two lovers in the last uh, 12 years, and um, if, if a bunch of people had sex and they thought I'd be jealous, um, I'm not because her ancestors took away her healing gifts and gave me and the body that they were passing around. Um, I don't know who came back from Dallas, but that wasn't the world that I was dating. And, uh, <clears throat> how much do you know about this? Yeah, I, I can't wait to find out myself. Um, you don't have to tell me, but I, I'll, I'll find out eventually. And then uh, this doesn't really have anything to do with Although, I, I do need some business done here. Uh, did, did you know that the house needs some work? Yeah. Contractors keep calling, hoping that I'm dumb enough to fall for it. But uh, it's kind of complicated, and it's not my house. Uh, and the water well is definitely sabotaged. It's the most obvious thing in the world. So, what do you think I should do? And tell me again why your heart was broken when you saw me allegedly smoking meth on camera. I mean, what the fuck do you care? Like, seriously. Oh, that's right, you've got a relationship with some guy pretending to be me. <laughs> Dana, give up.